Um, this is my latest creation. Um, I'm pretty much assuming this this would be a tideborne generator. I, I guess an airborne equivalent could be made, uh, but it's something that's going to be much more easily created if it's neutrally buoyant, and that's going to be very easy in the not very easy, you know, fairly easy in the sea. Uh, you have a top frame, uh, preferably steerable. Yeah, stiffened top frame and a uh, tensioned. I guess it would be more than just that single rope coming from a hub at the back. That's um, but you have these fans, uh, turbine blades, all the way around. Sets of those and as the water comes through, it's pretty much got no chance but to hit one of the blades and spin it. Um, would be good because it's on a tether, a bit like a kite, you can see it's neutral point, to be able to wind it across the sky like that. I say across the sky, this is from underwater from the seabed. If it was flying, if you did make it neutrally buoyant, yes, that, that would be good. But you'd need quite a bit more surface to uh, wing surface to get that to to work. Um, once again, you had an arch there, a bunch of these rings, and another arch at the back, another arch of kites. Could be done. Generation, I'm assuming, is going to be done. On the front ring with this model uh, because these turbine rings are um, strung together and in tension they'll be driving the front ring but I don't think I have um, so the front ring would be driven by all these turbine blades behind um, and either you'd have generation through here or you'd use this to drive a band on top you know drive a motor there and you could have it around about, I guess. Let me know what you think.